Is the swim team in the building? I said it's the swim team in the building. Let's drown these and get these gold medals. Scribe. Today's video is gonna be interesting. And my dad smoked cuz we had the same plush. Birthed a bunch of blunts and then we caught the same buzz. My mama called my dad and said I caught your son for you. I started laughing and said, "Baby boy, yeah." Today we're gonna break forks. Now I'm not gonna lie, bro. I said I'm not gonna do no more wave videos. I've been watching a lot of the channels, like the, the new wave channels coming up, no offense. Cause a lot of the videos I've been watching, bro, they, they low key boring. Bang. I'm not gonna hold you. A lot of y'all videos is low key boring, huh? I can understand why the people who been doing it, why they videos kinda boring, cause YouTube not really treating us right. <laughs> like if you knew. Cool, son. God, videos are trash. But anyway, look, before we go any further, I want you to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, leave a comment, you feel me? If you learned something, leave a comment. Um, what I think I'm gonna start doing going forward with this channel is mostly to hear people that really get my notifications and stuff like that. I'm gonna start doing product reviews. I think the last couple product reviews I did on this channel, they went very, very well. So I'm gonna start doing product reviews. I'm gonna start doing my story times on my family channel. So if you're not subscribed to the family channel, I'm probably gonna leave a link in the comment section, pin it up or whatever, and you know, follow the family channel. It's time I start separating the people who wanna have waves and people who wanna be wavy. Bang, 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 bang. The worst thing you can have in your pattern is a fork. Forks are like conjoined waves, you feel me? They make little patterns like this. They might be a Y, it might be a little T. You know, it just depends. You might have a little zigzag. Those are forks. You can have the perfect pattern, but a fork will mess it up. You know what I'm saying? Like, a fork is the difference between and I see what you're going for. Yeah, I see what you're going for. That's the difference with a fork. Like, somebody would really look at your waves, your joints will look fire but just because of that little fork man, i see what you was going for you know what i'm saying <sighs> getting rid of forks you need a comb i'm gonna leave the link to this comb in the description but i love this comb it's missing some teeth right now you feel what i'm saying but i love this comb the pattern i had before i scalped i got this comb and it helped with breaking a lot of my forks but you can use any fine teeth comb but i personally suggest this joint right here now you're supposed to comb with your pattern but the way I be doing it is I kind of angle it and go so if my pattern is going this way I'll go straight you feel me this way I'll go straight down it's kind of like I'm let's say this is the, the flow of my pattern right like this so I would brush it or I'll comb it like this like that I'll comb it like that you feel what I'm saying not like straight on I kind of angle it a little bit I think that helps with force. Sometimes I'll go in and I'll like lift my um my waves up. It could be the thumbnail Boom, right like here. that. So I comb backwards, then I comb forwards. Comb backwards, comb forwards. Now I do that for probably like 30 minutes. When you're trying to get waves, right? You, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no time limit, dog. The one thing I can say, okay, if you're trying to, it's it's like. You gotta kind of dedicate yourself if you want a perfect pattern. If you just want it for looks, then you know it is what it is. Just you can have forks as long as people can see you have waves in the distance. I'm pretty sure you'll be fine with that. But it's other people who want their waves to be perfect, flawless. It's kind of like working out. If you want a flawless body or you want strength with your flawless body, you gotta put in the time. So that's kind of what getting waves is now. I'm not into the politics of waves. I didn't really realize there was politics in waves until I like started doing YouTube. So I'm just trying to make my joint look fire. I'm pretty sure I'm, you know, I'm trying to help you get some pum pum. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to help you get some vajayjay, right? 
I know with my ways, that's that's how I was pulling them. So, but you can go to my other channel so you can learn, you can learn how to how to use your mouthpiece and actually get to that. Anyway, <clears throat> next what you need to do is brush. My brush of choice is a Torino Pro. This one has seen better days, but this is a medium hard. I got this brush from Craig. Shout out to my boy Craig, man. He over there at Tipsy Tulips. They sell um, liquor infused pastries, which are freaking delicious. My man Craig gave me this joint right here. He gave me another one and I don't know where it is. I feel as though my son did something to it. But I love this. I love this brush. This is the first Torino Pro brush I've owned, to be honest with you. All I used before that was Magic Waves Curve Brush. Those are like my go-to. All right, so what you gotta do is you have to brush your pattern. So after you comb, and you feel as though you put in enough work with your comb, you're gonna take your, your brush, preferably a Torino Pro, or ref, but preferably just a medium, and you're gonna boom. Now the way my pattern is now, it was not like that a couple months ago. I'm gonna make a video showing how I easily, effortless, effortlessly shifted my pattern. I'm gonna make another video showing that. But the way my pattern is now is kind of, I feel as though it's more of a 540. You know what I'm saying? At certain angles, if you look at it, it looked like a 360, but it's more of a 540 with a swirl. I'm working on the swirl. I'm doing my best to 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 get one of those swirls I've never seen before. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to find the angles for it, but I feel as though it's close. It's close. So <clears throat> before my pattern was looking 720-ish, and I was not going for a 720. I just feel as though 720 is not the 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 pattern I'll go for in my wave journey. I'm I know for sure I'm never gonna have that. You know what I'm saying? It's, they don't fit my personality. But as I was brushing, the angles I was brushing, it was kind of like a 720, and I didn't like that. So I, I did my best, and I shifted it, and I feel as though I like the direction it's going right now. But with my brushing, I brush my pattern. You feel me? Just brush my pattern in. Make sure I catch the right angles, because the wrong angles could, could send you in a whole different direction, and you know you want to make everything make sense. Every angle, every, you feel me, every wave have to make sense in your pattern. For me, I know what I want. I want to have the waves where I take my do-rag off and people that got long hair and dreads and all that want to cut their joint off and get waves, you feel me? I want my waves to be on some, I want my waves to be so crazy that people with waves put their do-rag on when I take mine off. You feel me? Like, that's, that's what I want. So, in order to get that, you need to... You need to bang your angles out. You need to get your angles right and you gotta make sure your pattern makes sense. So now after you do that combing and you do the brushing, what you need to do now is throw the secret sauce on. Now, everybody got their own secret sauce. Y'all know what mine is, you know what I'm saying? But you throw your secret sauce on and you do it again. Comb, brush. Now the combing part, you don't really gotta go in on it. You feel me? There's times when you should, but right now you don't really gotta go in on it. You already went in on it on the first time. You already went in the first time you started combing your head. This time it's just a little, you know what I'm saying? Just a, some light movements. Try to pick up some hair and lift it and, and move it. Try to pick up some hair and move it, move it around, you know what I'm saying? But that brushing, you gotta go in. Second round of brushing, you gotta go in. You feel me? Like, you have to go in. Because right now you got the. You know what I'm saying? Right now you got the secret stuff in your head. So what you gotta do now is, boom. Just, just put that work in. Put that work in. And once you put your do-rag on, the secret stuff is gonna hold everything together. It's gonna hold everything together. Now, once you take the dewey off, once you, once you take the dewey off, you feel what I'm saying? The hole's not gonna be able to stay off of you. You see that? Now I got some forks right there, but, hold on. My light at. So, so. You feel me? It's it's no it's no it's no games out here. What the hell going on? Okay, there we go. See what I'm saying? It's no it's no games out here. 
It's none. No games is being played out here. At all. At, at, at all. There's no games being played out here. You feel what I'm saying? None. None. We we out here. We psh, Jesus. Ho he ho ho ho. Look like a goddamn ghetto angel. Stop playing with me. You feel what I'm saying? Aqua Laz is in the building, man. Aqua Aquaman Laz is definitely in the building. We out.